is up guys hold here welcome back some more of our pokemon blaze black 2 redux randomized nuzlocke last time oh i gotta sneeze okay never mind uh it's one of those sneezes you know it's right there and then it's just not all of a sudden last time hate that we got we got here to drift bell um looked around got a bunch of encounters we're gonna get a bunch more encounters today oh you know what i hit randomize let's fish why not this uh this one right here so we get our we're gonna get an encounter for this route or get an encounter for the oh it's not okay uh never mind we're getting an encounter right here <laughs> uh encounter in clay tunnel because it's open and then we have <gasps> friend okay we don't need more grass types currently but that's a pretty good one well it could be a pretty good one um Level 35? I know you're... Uh, what are... I don't know Shroomish's base stats. Can I nature power you? You know what? Nature power, I think, would... Uh, it would be... Let's see. We're in the grass. I think it's seed bomb. I'm gonna do it. Okay. I am not going to do that anymore. Okay. <laughs> um, what do I have? Do I really have anything to? Well, okay. If I go into four while the sun's up and I aqua jet. Okay. Surely. Okay, I need a little more damage than that. Stop with the counters. Bubble beam. Uh, yawn. And then we'll bubble beam again and then start throwing balls. They shouldn't take too long. Worry seed? Okay. Interesting moveset on this Shroomish. And asleep, the grumpy boy goes. Uh, there is a gift encounter that it's like one of the only ones I like really knew about uh, that we're going to have a little bit of fun with. But we'll get there when we get there. Okay, Shroomish was caught. Cool. Uh, it spouts poison spores from the top of its head. These spores cause pain all over if inhaled. What do I... Because Breloom... Hmm. I'm going to name it pizza because mushroom pizzas are fantastic. And that's, <laughs> that's my reasoning. All right. Uh, oh, I should look. Pokemon changes shroomish. Um, it's ability. Wait, why it has an old and new if they didn't change? I don't know. Breloom. Uh, Technician, the hidden ability of Breloom might be... So if we have Effect Spore, then we have Technician or it's Poison Heal. Um, neither of which are bad abilities, for sure. Especially since we have the Toxic Orb. Um, we can't Surf yet. No, we don't even have the HM or Surf. But, okay, cool. So, that's the Route Encounter. Let's go in here. And get this Encounter before we uh, we start getting tokens. Pseudo Wudo. Okay, it's kind of weird that we happen to get type matching Pokemon in the routes. That makes me wonder, is the randomizing working? Hold on. Yes. Okay, I just double checked both routes. Neither of these Pokemon. It, it was just a really freaky coincidence. But Coat Rack, hello. Uh, please don't kill me. God, please do not kill me. It's going to Kenny. Kasurudo can do damage. Oh. Charm.
Nice. Okay, stop the rollout. Good shit. Uh, let's hit you with... We're only three levels higher. Uh, Moonblast, not stab. Okay. Very nice. Another Moonblast. I do love me... Ooh, I thought that was a crit for a second. Do love me a good Sudo. Uh, hopefully the good part remains true. We shall see. Uh, great ball it up. And while we do that, let's go Pokemon changes. I have a look at Sudo Wudo. Can't find Sudo. Oh, I hit move changes on Pokemon changes. That would be why. There's no move. Sudo? What do you mean you can't find Wudo? I know you guys can hear the every time I hit it, it's like, no. What do you mean, no? <laughs> did they did they leave my man Suda Wudo off the list? Let me search Bonsley. Okay, I found Bonsley. Bonsley got a stat a BST increase. What? What number is Suda Wudo? I just gotta search the number. Did they type it wrong? Am I typing it wrong? I don't know. Get in the ball, Sudo Udo, please. It's 185. I don't know why it wouldn't find it. Whatever. Uh, Sudo Udo did get a BST increase from 410 to 465. Stop that. That's right. That's right. Um, do I need to put you to sleep too? I might. Hold on. You're charmed. Going to fork. So the stat increase, it, its HP went from 70 to 90. Attack went from 100 to 115. Defense went from 115 to 225, or two, 125. Can you imagine, 225. Move over, Steelix. Uh, yawn. Uh, special attack stayed the same. Special defense went from 65 to 75 and speed stayed the same. Uh, solid stuff. Just increasing the things that Sudowoodo does, uh, does well to make them even better. Oh yeah, the Citrus Berry. I was like, what just happened? That's fine. Okay. Uh, I should go to sleep after this turn, but please. I gotta go buy more Great Balls after this. There we go. Didn't even quite fall asleep. Was about to. All right. But of course, you already know this is Coat Rack. To avoid being attacked, it does nothing but mimic a tree. It hates water and flees from rain. Our boy. Coat Rack. And hopefully, uh... Hopefully they're good. Run to the PC and see real quick. Hello? Hello, is this Poldu? I'll just think out loud. I love Electro-type Pokemon. Many of them look cool, I think. I hope you like Electro-type Pokemon too. Oops, my colleague is calling me. I have to get back to work. Goodbye. Thanks, Curtis. Thanks. He's called a few times uh, while I've been grinding with other worthless things. So I haven't bothered to like, oh, I gotta drop everything and, and start recording again. So I show Curtis. I don't, I don't understand the point of Curtis. Uh, maybe one day we will. But let's see, we have Brave Nature. Oh, well, that's not good. Uh, we did get Effect Spore, which, what did I say? I think, yeah, yeah, Effect Spore becomes Technician. Plus attack, great. Minus speed, not, not great because Brelum, Brelum needs that speed. Didn't get a, a BST change. I don't know what Brelum's base speed is right offhand. Uh, it is 70. Yeah, that, that really fucks. Okay. Well, RIP the pizza. Uh, Jolly. <laughs> That's... It doesn't hurt us. Um, it's just kind of useless. So like, 
Sudoodle doesn't have special attack or speed. Uh, I think they are actually both base 30. So... There's that. Uh, it's a sturdy mon, but it's not a negative nature. It's essentially a neutral nature, uh, which is which is perfectly fine. But okay, <laughs> there we go. There, there's that. Now let's uh, go turn in the token encounters. I think we'll go get grass for uh, maybe we'll do one of each. Actually, I, I think I just healed, but do one of each let me buy balls then we'll go out there all right randomize button has been hit this will be for the turtwig not that it really matters which one but this is for one of them and our encounter is okay uh i used one of these just in normal bdsp uh it was terrible uh, but it was fun to use whenever death wasn't, you know, something to fear. Um, though, this is one of those, like, it, I could see this thing getting a pretty sizable buff. Finneon. Finneon did not get any BST, uh, boosts. Oh, I thought you were gonna play nice. Uh, did get a shuffle, but Luminion did get a boost. So Lumineon went from 460 to 485. Uh, I can't really attack. Well, I mean, let's go to four. Um, it's attack or HP went from 69 to 70. Just per defying the numbers. Physical attack went from 69 down to 43. Okay. Physical defense went from six, 76 down to 75. Who made Lumineon's base stats? And why do they put random numbers in? What is this? What? Yawn. Protected by safeguard. Oh, I haven't been paying attention to what it's been doing. Damn. It was ready. That's unfortunate. Uh, Bubble Beam. Oh. I see. That's a really good ability. Uh. Oh, great. Okay. Ooh, ooh. This actually might be like a. I hate to say it's a better water type than pork, but it might be a better water type than pork. Uh. Anyway, let's see. Defense 76 to 75. Special attack from 69 up to 105. Special defense from 86 up to 90 and speed from 91 to 102. That's a good Pokemon. It's now compatible with the team for Hurricane, the Wingfish. What level does Finneon even evolve? Because Finneon did get a, a BST shuffle. I didn't bother going over that because I figured it was high enough level to like kind of immediately evolve, but I don't recall. 31, yeah. The line running down its side can store sunlight. It shines vividly at night. Oh, there's the sneeze from earlier. Coming in <laughs> super late. Uh, but I shall... No, let's use the mouse. Shall name you Neon. Okay, hoping your nature is good. Because, like, honestly, yeah, that's that could be a great Pokemon. Yeah, an absolutely fantastic one. Uh, you know what? We'll, we'll wait. Let's go and get the other token, which we'll get in Clay Tunnel. And let's not do a Dust Cloud, even if it pops up. Randomize button is hit. And we have... Oh! A lizard. Okay. Sceptile, huh? Giga Drain. We are superior. Uh, Sceptile, let's see. Oh, Sceptile is a new type combination. I'm assuming Grass Dragon. Yup. It did get a five BST buff. Looks like a little bit of a reshuffling as well. So it's HP is the same. It's physical attack went from 85 to 105. Uh, let's get drained again. Uh, physical defense from 65 up to 67. 
special attack from 105 down to 185 or 105 down to 85 so it's more so embracing the physical side uh special defense went from 85 up to 88 and then still has 120 base speed uh another giga drain you know thinking about it i probably shouldn't have been leading google for like a range of encounters because what if we ran into like an entei or <laughs> or something terrifying uh i just gave it permanent sunny day which we don't really have like outside of airlock we don't really have much to stop um because i would like to fight flannery today and she is undoubtedly like her torkoal is undoubtedly drought um so she's gonna be a sun team and i don't i don't know how i feel about that grass whistle huh we're gonna go into fork hit yawn Okay, I was about to say, do not. I thought we just lost the encounter. Okay. Go to sleep. I am going to Aqua Jet you in the sun, and then you, what, times four resist this? Oh, uh, I, was, I was hoping it might, at the very least, take it in the red. I can hit it with Bubble Beam. Still. Okay, well, before the sleep wears off, I guess. Great ball. Come on. Hey, there we go. Okay. So, Sceptile, what are we going to name you? The leaves that grow in its arms can slice down thick trees. It is without peer in jungle combat. Okay, I had the intrusive. I'm letting the intrusive thoughts win. Uh, and naming it. Okay, this fits with spaces. <laughs> naming it Lee Z. Uh, go back to QWERTY space. Erd. Leezerd. I don't. I don't really have an explanation for that, it, but it happened uh, <laughs> to the PC. All right, let's go ahead, release these two. And, oh, there we go. All right, brave. Why? Why? It's highest IV is special attack, which is fantastic. Um. Why do you have to be negative speed? Like positive attack is uh, like worthless as well, but man. So I don't know about this being a better water type than fork anymore. Uh, it's still a solid one, like especially with the buffs, the coverage it can get, the speed it should have. All right, and lizard. What is this one? Lax? That's fine. It doesn't affect offenses. It doesn't affect speed, most importantly. Um. Okay. I feel like <clears throat> this is a tough one to use because unless it's... Let's see. I'm still here on, on its moveset. Oh, we got Overgrow. It could have had Unburden, uh, which would have been nice. Like, where's Leaf... Leaf Blade is level 50? Are you kidding me? All these mons are out here with cracked moves at like starting since like level 25, but you don't get Leaf Blade until 50. You don't get Leech Seed until 43. What the fuck? Breaking Swipe is back at 36, which is a pretty good move. Uh, Night Slash, good coverage move at 34. Oh, I say back at 36. W leveling up to 36, it's not there yet. Um, so there's good moves to obtain, just like its main move that you want is at 50. That sucks. Oh well. Uh, all in all, not a bad mon. Uh, but okay. Solid encounters. 
Do I do we go straight to Flannery? I might I might scope out Route Six because the the thing I was talking about before, fun with a gift Pokemon, is I believe on Route Six. Let me just see how far we can really go up there. Oh, we can get all the way high. Please don't. Did I accidentally start a double battle? No. We got all the way here. Um, this is where I think we're gonna have some fun with it. Oh no. Oh no. I put Caterpie up front just to run from wild Pokemon while I ran up here. That's fine. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. Ooh, another one. Oh, oh good. Oh good. Okay. Stop that. Oh man. Uh, there's an item. Oh, you are a battle. So, oh, I guess this game just doesn't do that. Thank God. Okay. I, man. I'm trying to go in the building, but then there's also the item right there. It's just, it's a Parasect. We air slash you and you, why did you X special attack a Parasect? Who does that? Is everything all right at home? Uh, Boldor. Okay, normally I would switch out, but given the level discrepancy, like, yes, it has sturdy, but that's what it did with its time. E speed, not that it matters. Get out. Hypno, hello. Crunch, goodbye. Caterpie 42, hyper voice? I do want that. Do we really need E speed? I mean, we're base 95. We're plus speed nature. There are definitely things that will outspeed us. Um, I probably should keep, I mean, priority is really good. We do have a dark type and we just literally use crunch for coverage, but I would like hyper voice. Would very much like hyper voice. Okay. I hope you're not a trainer. You're not. Okay. What is this? Moon. Oh, Moonstone for Dinky. Okay. In we go. Oh, if we. Is there a PC in here? No. There's a gift Pokemon here. Is it you? My Pokemon weather forecast for you. Well, that's how it normally goes, but your recausability is none other than Airlock. That's a problematic one for me. It's funny that you. Since airlock turns off the effects of weather, it means my Pokemon weather forecast isn't too helpful. That's hilarious. What? Hold on. Your sunflowers, uh, sunflower's ability is drought. For a trainer like you, here comes a Pokemon weather forecast. Using the move Sunny Day or sending out a Pokemon with the ability to drought will cause the sun to shine brightly. When it's sunny, the power of fire type moves will be boosted by 50%. Yeah, weather ball. Growth. Uh... Pokemon can't be frozen, and frozen Pokemon are defrosted. Cast form. Do you... Yes. Oh my god, please stop talking. Oh my god. It was neat that you pointed out <laughs> Airlock, but then you kept going. Which one of you... It's a very special porcelain. Will you raise it for us? You're traveling with lots of Pokemon already. Let me go deposit someone and then we're gonna come back for that porcelain. I swear, if this is Curtis again. Hello, is this Poldu? Rock is great. I was listening to music just now. The music is wonderful, it gives me energy. I wonder what your favorite music is. My colleague is calling me, I have to get back to work. It's Metalcore, Curtis. God damn it. All right. Uh, will you raise this Corsola for us? Yes, here you are. Take good care of it. You've received a Corsola. Uh, no. 
That Corsa's ability is Regenerator, and it's also a shiny Pokemon. It also comes from the Galar region, but it's still in the form we see here. Most Corsal and Galar have taken upon a ghost typing and inflicts curse upon anything unlucky enough to touch them. It's a result of sudden climate change. It's a shame, really. Uh, yes, so... This Corsola is shiny. Um, it's not random shiny, it is just always shiny. And I thought it'd be fun to whatever we will throw it out as a token. And whatever we get, I'll make shiny. I don't, there's probably like a shiny action replay code that I could find. Uh, I'll just, I'll just do the science in the background, you know. Uh, just change it into a shiny while we're here. Did I talk to everyone else? I don't remember. Just making sure. Okay. Um, I think that'd be a fun thing to do. Should we do it right now? Let's do it right now. I hit randomize. And down the grass we go. Our shiny token is Teddy Ursa. Okay. I kind of like, you know, like green shinies tend to get a lot of flack. Um, Teddy Ursa is one I quite like. Just a lime green gummy bear. What do I want to do with you? Um, I feel like you probably got a, a nice buff. I'm just great ball. You probably got a buff in this game, I would imagine. Let's see. Teddy Ursa did not uh, No. Oh, Ursaring, it did, uh, did get a type change. Thank you for your cooperation. Ursaring is normal ground. Hmm. Okay. The little bear Pokemon. It lets honey soak into its paws so it can lick them all the time. Every set of paws tastes unique. What? Okay. Uh, I mean, I feel like I, I have to name you Gummy Bear. You're gonna be lime green. Uh. Or you know what? Well, maybe maybe fruit fruit gummy, but you know, like without the R. Fruit gummy. There we go. Uh, no stat changes. What is Ursaring? Like I I feel like you know Ursaring can do some damage, but you know it's not the best thing in the world, Liz. Not fast, that's for damn sure. Um, Anma. Anma's a good shiny, too. Um, it has base 130 attack, and 75 in defense, special attacks, uh, and special defense, 90 HP, and 55 speed. <laughs> Whopping 55 speed. Okay. Um, what nature did we get? And the ability didn't change, so. What abilities can you have? Aren't you a quick feet mon? Guts, quick feet, or unnerve? And the survey says. Oh, uh, pickup becomes guts. Hmm. We don't have a flame orb, we have a toxic orb. Uh, but either way. And then a uh, fuck. Oh, you know what? For, I was gonna say another fucking brave nature. For this, that's actually fine. Like, our speed is really bad to begin with. 55 speed. Like, unless we were quick feet, then maybe there'd be a problem. But we're not quick feet. We're guts. So, I'm okay with that. All right. I'll make you nice and green. Uh, let's get rid of this Corsola. And now I guess Flannery. I don't know what time, how how much time we have left, but we'll see. I completely forgot that this pavilion was here. Whenever I did the whole town thing, I was like, "Oh, let me check in here real quick." This guy wanted a level four. Wanted me to show him a level forty or higher Pokemon. And gave me an expert belt. Uh, nice. Uh, and then while I'm here, I'm sure you sell Moo Moo milks. Oh, I I I bought a single bottle of Moo Moo milk. Uh, this guy sells all of the stones which is pretty nice. Um, then there's an item on the Charles side entrance. So go over here. Uh, where's the, there we go. 
What is this? That's a that's a good TM. Okay, nice. All right. I found her. I couldn't remember which building she was in. I gave Caterpie the light orb. Uh, Fork has the expert belt that we just got. And that's all we really got. That's that's it. <laughs> So let's just hope for the best. Oh, this place is big. It's nothing in my hometown. I'm Flannery. I'm the one in charge of the Lava Ridge town in Hoenn. The atmosphere here is so heated, I'm simply burning to battle. Let's exchange some super hot moves. I'm gonna demonstrate the hot moves I hone close to a volcano. That Gen 3 music. Pretty, pretty nice touch. Very, very good addition with the update. Leading with the Torkoal. Oh, was no doubt Drought, which is why I didn't put uh, Fork up front. Wait. Because I'm faster, did Airlock... Wait. <laughs> did it work that way? I'm gonna Dragon Pulse you. Level 35, dead. Okay. Makarga. Oh. So we're, we're a bit higher level. I mean, we also have a level 42 Rayquaza, our highest level leading the charge. Are you sturdy? No. scared but then I was like wait it's still a Macargo it doesn't outspeed us Caterpie 43 Hound Doom this might just be a Caterpie sweep her being 34 what wasn't hold on let me go to the trainer changes uh Elisa wasn't Elisa 36 uh oh wait no uh yeah, why are you a lower level? I, is this the first Hoenn gym leader to be lower than the main gym? Maybe I haven't been paying attention. They've all been more threatening. Though I guess it's kind of hard to be more threatening than Elisa of all people. So like, RIP Flannery. <laughs> all right. Crit. Rotom Heat? I'm getting uh, low on HP. I am getting kind of worried. Though I guess there's nothing for me to... I, I popped on the life board for a reason. Like, I don't want to get hit. Uh... Do you think you're... If this is like Evil Light Magmar, I need to heal. Okay, I probably shouldn't have used a Hyper, but I do need to heal. Willow. Well. I guess we don't have to worry about another accidental hour-long episode because this won't be a 30-minute fight. I'm sorry, Flannery. You were supposed to be higher level. But we just have a Rayquaza, so die. Camera probably lives a hit, right? But Macargo lived a hit? Damn. Did Macargo get... Well, we did get almost bodied by that Slugma. I'm pretty sure he did get a buff. <laughs> All right, well... I may have lost the match, but I'm completely satisfied. Are you? You took out 6 0 swip swept. You used one move. No, two moves. And you missed the second one. It's not often that I get to enjoy a battle that heated. 
Well, that's all the loose ends accounted for, I believe. Um, oh wait, I'm recording this on a Thursday. Uh, there should be a bird. Hold on. I was just thinking about loose ends. There's nothing behind us. No, there's a bird that only appears on Thursday. A static encounter that we get to use as a token. And it only shows up on Thursday. Let me go find it. There it is. Okay, I was looking all around. It's like, I can't find it. Go away. Oh. Fred. Oh, God. I thought the game crashed. I was like, we're in this area where it, things got weird. Uh, but okay. Another static. Hell yeah. So now, catch or kill either way. Now, all the things will be... Ah. Oh, will be cleaned up all the loose ends uh that we've left behind us anyway what level are you 30 okay well uh hit you with a yawn block wait does that mean i can't i don't think well you can't amanda buzz nine levels I think I can Aqua Jet it. I really do. Mandibuzz is pretty bulky. Oh, yeah. Especially, you know, I can... Based on that Aqua Jet, I can Bubble Beam it. And uh, be fine. The so Bubble Beam... Okay. Uh, asleep, not quite in the red, but Great Ball. Play nice, please. Yeah. All right. Another token. We might as well get it, right? We did all the other tokens, all these other encounters. Let's end the episode with one final encounter. Why not? All right. I think we're going to get the token in Play Tunnel because we did the, the shiny and one of the other statics outside. I don't want the, the dust cloud. I want, I want the encounter to be raw. That's dupes. We're gonna species. Not a bad one to double up on, but I also still feel like without being at the level that we can have a Hydreigon, it's not really worthwhile. What else? I... I spoke into it into existence earlier, I guess. I specifically mentioned, hey, I probably shouldn't be leading or with Google in case I run into a fucking Entei and then I boost it with Sun. Hi! Go to sleep. What is Headlong Rush? What is that? These fucking Legends Arceus moves. Headlong Rush. That is a ground type move. What is it in this game? Like base power and stuff. Because in Legends Arceus, it's base 100 and also lower. Oh, it lowers the user special. Of, okay, so it just did that. Oh, is it ground type close combat? Uh, head along. It's base 120. Accuracy is 90. Ooh, not nearly as good as close combat. It's still 5 PP. Huh. Okay. Um. Get me the fuck out of here. But also now I can't... How am I going to hit it? Yeah, go sleep. Um. I'm going to go into... Hestia, I guess. It's minus one, but it's an Entei. I should be able to hit it. <laughs> Wake up, slap. And then send it right back to sleep with hypnosis. Uh, side shock so I don't crit. Hopefully. How much damage does that do? At minus one. Oh, okay. Yeah, side shock again. Woke up. Raging Fury.
hold on 128 minus 74 how much did i just do 54 okay hypnosis Custap berry ah. go sleep go sleep go sleep go sleep oh it might kill itself caterpie actually i should have just stayed and healed i don't know why it I panicked, okay? Don't hit yourself. Don't do it. Raging Fury. Okay. Uh, now let's... Hyper Potion, Hestia. And... Just start throwing. We'll do the first one together and like all the other legends. Yeah. All right, let's get it. It'll either kill itself or we catch it. Whatever happens first. Yep. All right. God damn it. I was trying to put it back to sleep. I kept missing because of course I did. Fork wants to learn Steel Wing. Uh, no, I'd rather have Smart Strike. Smart Strike doesn't miss. Steel Wing can. No Entei. Damn. All right. Well, what, uh, let's see. Pokemon changes. Anything changed? Like, clearly moveset. Uh, no stats or anything. Dang. All right. Well, on we go. Or I guess off we go, because that's the end of today. Uh, I guess we're going to the gym next. That's scary but yeah we, we don't really have anything else so that's gonna do it i will make the the gummy bear actually green in between episodes uh but lots of encounters a flannery fight or flannery solid stuff thank you all for watching hopefully you enjoyed and i will see you next time bye